One of the best parts about this new civil label manager tool is being able to target multiple elements when you're labeling. So to open this tool, I'm under drawing production labels, and I'm going to hit this arrow right here called civil label manager. An example from the Bentley delivered XML is if you expand the civil labels, plan points, this station elevation label, you can see here that it's pointing to this text favorite called Civil Labeler Plan Station Elevation. And if I click here, it'll open the text favorite manager. And if I go to this one right here, you can see that it's using a text favorite for the um, feature name, the feature station, and then a point elevation. And so these are going to be two different elements that we're getting information from. And right here is where you can select if it's going to get all of, all of the information from one element or multiple. So right here, select just means that you're going to first select the element that you need. And then that's the prompt that you're going to find right here to know. So identify baseline geometry. Now for the second line for this target two field, it's going to be using the same um, element as the first, so you'll select same as one. If you wanted to select a different one, you would hit select, and then you can see that the colors are changing up here to help you be able to visualize how many um, elements you need to select. I'll change that back to same as one. And then this one is where you're going to be selecting a point to be labeled. So within the manager tool to be able to place this, I'll go to my placement tab and hit the place command. So you can see, identify the baseline geometry, I'll select this line here, and now identify points to be labeled, I'll select the point, and then I'll drag it out to where I want it and place it. And I'll scroll in and you can see that it has the name of the alignment, the offset of the point from the alignment, and then the point elevation.